Hi, I'm Peter Kalmström of Kalmström.com Business Solutions. In this demonstration, I will talk about building an orders list for tables. Uh, of course, you want to keep track of all the orders of all the different types. And as you see to the left here, I've already created two lists for flowers and computers. And now I'm just going to do another example for tables. So I'll add an app for table orders. Do a custom list for that and call it tables like that and each list that you create from the custom list template has one title field that's all it has that's the only field and you could possibly hide that but it's better to reuse it so that's what we're going to do and also i'm going to enable versioning settings on this list those are the two most important steps that i'm going to do and then i'm going to figure out what information do we need around our tables we're going to reuse that title field and just make it a comment field so that people can specify some additional comments around their table and we'll actually not make that required it will not be a mandatory field so of course i'm not just renaming this title field in this list now it will still be called title all over the place in other places where that reusable column is used all right so now we have a comments field and then i'm going to create another column for the type of table that we need and that's of course going to be a choice column we have very specific types of tables that we use in our organization to have a consistent look. So here we go. There is the types. We have the uh, standing table. We have the conference table. And I'm going to just type that in in the right order. Of course, you do want them in alphabetical order. And then I have a regular desk. And the default will be a regular desk. So let's do that. That's the default choice. And then, of course, we will have a department where that's going to be used, this table, or actually the house where it's going to be placed is a better option. So let's do that. Of course, you will customize this for your own needs. And you can just type that in. Please uh, specify where the table should be delivered. Right, okay. So there we go. Now I have my tables and of course I do want to change the column ordering to make the type of table first one and where it's placed the second one and then the comments as the third. That would be nice. Another thing that you might want to disable is that you don't want the users to have the option of adding attachments to these orders. That doesn't really make sense. All right, let's test it out. We have the tables there. And I'm creating, clicking on new, and there's the choice of type of desk. I want a standing table, and I want it to be delivered to the green building, and um, should be suitable for parties. That's what I want for my table. And then I save that, and then we're done. We have my order form for tables. Thank you for watching this demonstration.